What is going on guys? We are back with another video today and we are doing another career re-simulation on Madden 21 and today is a pretty decently sought after or uh, I wouldn't say sought after <laughs> and I don't know about that now uh, suggested one being Jamarcus Russell a guy that a lot of people would probably consider the biggest bust I wouldn't say greatest because it's not great but the biggest bust of all time uh, obviously a lot of people thought he was going to be great out of college but unfortunately, that is not the case, and uh, the Raiders learned that the hard way. They drafted him with the first pick overall, and he was literally a bust right out the gate. There was no, there was no like, oh, here's down the line, like kind of like a, like a worse Mitchell Trubisky. And you guys probably thinking, really? How? How is this po Yeah, worse than that. And okay, so of course, with that being said, we have made him in Madden, Jamarcus Russell. Uh, he actually kind of looks similar. I'm looking at the two pitchers here. Not the worst, right? Uh, we gave him top skills. We gave him decent skills because he was uh, touted as a good player. It just didn't work out that way. So, with that being said, he's a 75 overall here, which isn't, you know, it's not bad. I remember there's somebody saying, you know, there was an analyst saying that he liked the likeness of John Elway, <laughs> which obviously did not happen. Uh, we did not want to give him superstar, by the way. Uh, I changed that to normal, and the game was like, no, you didn't. So for penalty, we gave him undisciplined. Throw ball away, yes, but his sense pressure is oblivious. And as far as uh, forcing passes goes, the best you can do for somebody that isn't good at, uh, you know, making good decisions is balanced, I guess. Conservative and ideal. I mean, I, I guess balance is the best we can do. Uh, as far as his actual ratings go, we gave him 82 speed, which yeah, may be a little generous. Probably could go down a little bit. 81, yeah, let's drop that a little bit. A little, little too generous. Uh, 81 strength, because obviously he was very strong. 79 awareness. You know, decent ball carrier kind of stuff. Uh, as far as throwing goes, we maybe made him a little bit better than he should be as well. But I wanted to be a decent overall because, once again, he, he was supposed to be good. It's just his decision making really made it the worst. I'll drop everything down by like three though, just so you know. Let's 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 keep him at as a 73 overall. Then yeah, screw it. Uh, still pretty good, you know. 73 overall. I'm not saying you're ecstatic if you get this pick in a draft, but it could be worse, I guess, right? Kinda. But regardless, let's take a look at who takes him and if he can turn his career around. Of course, we have to assume because of how bad it was in real life that he's pretty much guaranteed to do better here than his, you know, his actual uh, results because he literally all he has to do is beat 18 touchdowns, 23 picks, and 4,000 yards in a whole career. He might be able to do that his rookie year depending on who takes him. Ironically enough, don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, they're, they're the fourth worst team. So it looks like Detroit could go with like Stafford 0.7. 0.5? 0 0.3? I don't know. 0.1. 0.0001, I don't know. <laughs> but, it, I mean, it could, or he could go to the Patriots, but we'll find out. Uh, we're about to find out in a moment, I suppose. Let's uh, let's go on. Who cares about you know all this other crap? We'll take a look at the Super Bowl just since we're there. I don't know how that really affects things, but Buccaneers versus the Chiefs. The winner of that one is the Chiefs. Could happen in real life, you never know. So start of the draft, I mean, we should see this pick one, but you don't know. Lions could pass on him. And they do. If the uh, don't tell me, please not Miami. Thank you. Is it gonna be the Patriots? It's not. Don't do it. I gotta make sure that I don't have him on or anything like that. I don't have him, but he is scouted. Uh, obviously, there's some other quarterbacks who don't do it. L Las Vegas, don't. Please. Oh, they don't. Philadelphia. Jesus, they must have fucking. Uh, oh, jeez, that word. Oh, nice. <laughs> they must have heard about uh, the issues. Who's going to take him? I thought it was the Jaguars are going to take him. Where is he going to go? They knew about this. They knew this was going to happen. Where? Jets? No? Washington? How do they... Actual cheesers, man. Jamarcus Russell looks pretty good in his little, like, thingy. How do they know? How do... Cheaters... Did we just, like, expose EA for, for scripting? I feel like we just exposed EA for scripting. Normal development, and they're like, nah, you can't. He's still there in the Saints. 
the New Orleans Saints take Jamarcus Russell with their 28th pick of the draft. Okay, that is very interesting because he would, pr- I mean, obviously not be number one overall kind of sucks, but he would be pretty ecstatic with the location, right? You got to assume he'd be uh, pretty happy with that. Interesting, interesting, interesting. I really thought the Patriots were going to take him, honestly. Maybe even the Raiders are going to redo. Yikes. Uh, Okay, so let's go on and join the New Orleans Saints. Interesting. It worked out pretty well. I don't think that's a bust. That's not a bust, and we'll see if it is a bust. I don't know. All those things don't make any sense together, but I I know. He's also probably not going to start right away, right? I don't think he would. Is Drew still here? He might have retired. Quarterback situation in the New Orleans. Oh, he's gone. Okay. Russell's starting out the gate. This is an interesting one. You know, we haven't really had a super great amount of success in these for uh, their Super Bowls, but Jamarcus has a shot. He might actually win a Super Bowl here. He might actually become not a bust. As you can see, 10-6 and six to start her off once again. I don't have a horse in this race, so I don't really... Like, why would I cheat? I don't, I don't know. I mean... But yeah, Jamarcus Russell right out the gate with a dev up. He's already a 79 overall. 4,800 yards, 42 touchdowns, 20 interceptions. Rushing 144 for two touchdowns. Okay, um... Where this this is gonna happen? Jamarcus at number three. We got Darnold at number two. I don't even know what to tell you. I mean, things are just at this rate. The, the sky is upside down and the water's coming from the ceiling. Like I don't even know. I don't know if that what that even means. All right, playing the division rival Falcons and they win. Playing the Packers nine and seven again and there's another win. Breakout scenario in the championship game for Mr. Traquan Smith. Okay, let's go for it. Now I kind of want Jamarcus to win a Super Bowl here because I don't know how many times we're going to see a Super Bowl win in these. I will say a breakout's a bad sign, but not here because the Saints are OP. Who cares? Like, <laughs> who cares? Uh, because we have no clue as to when we'll ever see another Super Bowl for uh, a player, I think we're going to go for the Super Bowl. We're going to watch this. We're going to watch this play out. This is quite something. In Dallas. Let's take a look at Jamarcus Russell, the rookie sensation. <laughs> Raiders fans are like, you got to be damn kidding me. Can win a Super Bowl. Oh, Cincinnati. Okay, that was, a, that was a quick turn of events. Cincinnati on the board quickly. Of course, the Saints bouncing back at a very high rate. 14 all. 21 to 14. Okay, yeah, it's not looking great here. 21 to 17. New Orleans are on top. 31 to 21. 31 to 28. Oh no. The Saints choked. They lost. No Super Bowl title for Mr. Jamarcus Russell. They choked a 10 point lead with eight minutes left. What has happened in this last half decade? The last half decade has had choke after choke after choke. Unbelievable. Three touchdowns, one pick for Jamarcus. Uh, no rushing stats. Yeah, just kind of like a, a basic loss. Nothing nothing crazy. But obviously a really good season. Better than his whole entire career just in this one season. Nice. Of course, if he doesn't go to star, I don't know who would. Uh, star development, Jamarcus. He's, a not, he's an 87 overall. Look at this. I was thinking, oh, maybe we got ourselves a quick one. You know, maybe it's going to be that long. These are what the XP sliders are, unless I made a mistake. 130 quarterback. I I, uh, I guess I'll drop it slightly. I mean, we've been running these, and they've worked for the most part. I mean, we had it where was it? Was it Tom Brady? Somebody. There was a superstar player that didn't even get to 99, and they were having massive seasons, and they started off as like a superstar, maybe even an X-Factor, but like... Okay, <laughs> I guess that's the the world we live in where Jamarcus Russell is a top 15 quarterback after his rookie year. If you want to live in a world, well, I don't know if that's getting any likes and subs, but of course, out of the, the sellout realm, well, it's still a sellout realm, but the, the, the jokey realm, it would mean a ton if you subscribe. You don't have to. 
You don't even have to like the video. You just be in here and seeing your smiling, cute face. Assuming you're 18 or plus. I'm not going to comment on your looks if you're younger than that. <laughs> is good enough for me. I appreciate it. Of course, maybe check out the second channel, Picare Plays. has been doing cyberpunk over there. Twitter.com slash Jerome Picare. And you know, maybe twitch.tv slash Jerome Picare. But back to the video. Saints draft a star development free safety. Obviously, you know, kind of a need. If this team can manage their uh, cap situation well, they're obviously in a really good spot. They don't really need that many players. They're one of the best teams overall. So as far as, you know, these, these type of videos go... That's why we're kind of like, oh, maybe we got ourselves a Super Bowl because this team obviously is pretty damn loaded, especially oh, wide receivers looking a little rough, though. But uh, especially at like O-line, you know, the offensive line is insane. Everyone's star or better, if I'm not mistaken, unless somebody got you know traded or released or whatever. But yeah, I mean, star or better across the board. So, I mean, it's a really good team. Let's get on to it. All right, headed to the playoffs. And once again, as you would expect, the Saints repeat and they head to the playoffs. They lose to the Bucks. Lose to the Niners, Panthers, Ravens, and Falcons. They would have beat the Bucks in that one game. They would have taken the division, but of course they did not. Jamarcus Russell, a little bit of a down year comparatively, but obviously that's still massive. Uh, rushing a little bit better this year. Tom is obviously still the dude. As far as awards go, we were the number one offense as well. MVP, Jamarcus Russell, the best in the business but does not win MVP of the quarterbacks for the NFC side. He's the fourth best QB. All right, the Bears, that should be a walk in the park. And a, well, you know, not a walk in the park. But. And then they lose to the Niners. Of course, we'll take a look at that loss. See who wins the Super Bowl just for the F of it. The Bengals could go back to back here, which would make me cry. And I am tearing up. Back to you, Tom. So the wild card round that we thought would be a walk in the park, Jamarcus was pretty damn good, but... You know, yards were down a little bit. As far as the game that we actually lost in this one, uh, another really good... I mean, Jamarcus is crushing it. He's actually crushing the thing. And, I mean, we gave him bad traits. So, I, I guess traits don't matter. It's just about what's around you and, I suppose, some of your uh, your ratings. Like, he's in the 90s. I don't know if he got to Superstar. I'd imagine he probably did. And he did. Now, for this one, I think this is a good time as any to actually put regression on and just see what goes down like he's already played way better than he should so why not right why not let's see if he regresses why not can't wait till it's like oh jamarcus is now normal after an mvp season sweet surely they fixed regression by now no like a little bit even tiny bit no of course going into the uh about to be third year this is what the 26 pick looks like for the saints not looking great. I could see this being one of those maybe even one team situations. I mean, it's the perfect one. Like, I didn't force anything. Obviously, you guys seen I put him projected number one. The Saints do always. It's the Saints and Steelers always drafting those really good backup and then eventual starter quarterbacks. Obviously, in this one, they did draft him as a starter. But, I mean, I mean what can I say? It's just it worked out. It worked out, and he's already a god. But like I said, I think uh, outside of maybe like right at the end of his career, Jamarcus is probably going to stick around here. We'll see, though. The quarterbacks usually do get a re-sign no matter how. Well, unless they're like really bad. If they're really good, they're going to get the re-sign. I would love to see what that contract's going to look like. Jamarcus like <laughs> licking his lips here like, oh, come on. Why? Why? Obviously, still. I mean, I'll take I'll take that contract he got. 13-3 uh, for the Saints. I mean, it's not like he didn't want... To, well, I don't know. I don't, I don't really know the full story, but... Lost to the Buccaneers twice, but still uh, took the division. Like, obviously, he probably wanted to be a good player, but it just doesn't work out. I mean, none of us are players, so... Suck at us. <laughs> 4,100 yards, 59 touched, uh, yard. Ooh! 39 touchdowns, 10 picks. Uh, I can't really tell where that ranks. Like, he, it's still a really good season. Yards are down and whatnot, but touchdowns are slightly up. Troutman. I mean, is that guy actually good or what's the story? Uh, won MVP last year, did not win it this year. He's number eight, surprisingly, which is kind of low. Uh, looking at the NFC side, we could have an award or two. Russell at two. Damn. Uh, best QB, though. Damn, number two. He's getting scammed. But I will say, back in the playoffs again, in this time with a bye week. So uh, team leader looks like Cameron Jordan. Looks like he's going to be gone. No, Cameron. How dare you? It's unfortunate, but 
you know, all good things must come to an end. Detroit is in, and they whoop us. A team that I thought maybe could have thought about pulling the trigger, and they did not. Chris Castro just smoked us. That was the MVP, or not the MVP, but the NFC side's best player, I think. Jamarcus. That's the Jamarcus we know. Where Where's that Jamarcus been? Uh, not in like, okay. Not in like a, not in like a, wow, you've been playing really good, you moron. Like, uh, oh, look, it's the Raiders. Of all the teams to be in it, they lost. Who cares? I see you guys are probably a little interested in see the devs, and Jamarcus does not regress, so there you go. Well, actually, he may have. We, I don't know. Maybe he went to Superstar X Factor and then regressed instantly. That, that happens sometimes. He did not. Okay, fair enough. He's also wearing number 14. I'm not going to change it just because, like, nah, I will change it. I will change it. I mean, he came out of college as number two. He's been a god. You took him with a first-round pick. If that spot was open, I mean, who was it? Will Lutz, maybe, with that pick? Or with that uh, number? I don't know. What it, actually, it might be number four. Number three. I don't know who would have had number two, but, yeah, it makes sense to give him number f number two. Whatever. Now he's going to suck. Watch. Imagine he puts on number two, and it's just like drains his power like we're watching uh space jam all right this i mean this is looking like a decent pick number 22 really good selection uh very good corner there in the second round 24 but a good dt in the third not a bad draft from the saints also is this the year i believe that mr jamarcus is going to be getting that payday unless they give him a fifth year which i don't know if the ai can do oh the saints they do not go marching in they go marching out. I don't even know what that's supposed to mean, but loss of the Raiders, loss of the Packers at the end. The Raiders, though, the name keeps coming up. Jamarcus with another good season. Although, you look at those picks. They keep jumping. I think he's, like, added, like, an extra five or six picks every season outside of his rookie year. Obviously, Kamara just keeps destroying it. Uh-oh. The true Jamarcus is coming out. Where is he? Number six for MVP. Obviously, still dominating. Number three for Offensive Player of the Year. Uh, number three for Quarterback of the Year. Of course, you guys have also asked about, and not asked, you asked about Pro Bowl stats. Now, I am... No, I know, I know how to do it. Actually, you just go to these. It shows the awards, doesn't it? See the awards. Uh, three Pro Bowl appearances so far. Uh, a couple of Player of the Weeks. Of course, Rookie of the Year, Offensive Player of the Year, Best Quarterback. And then the following year, most valuable player, and then offensive player of the year. So some pretty high statistics for the man himself. And of course, as far as uh, Sean Payton is concerned, he's pretty much maxed out anyway. So, I mean, whatever. We'll just, if you want to. But yeah, I don't see why they wouldn't resign. I don't see why he wouldn't resign. Could be a massive one. Winner of the Super Bowl is the Buffalo Bills. Jamarcus Russell, once again, let's take a look at that dev, see if he went up and then went down. He did not. Okay, fair enough. Maybe they fixed reg uh, regressions. I don't know. All right, we're at the draft. The question is, is Jamarcus still here? He is. And, of course, you see those numbers. You see those numbers. The man, the, the one-man team, potentially. Uh-oh. I don't know what the actual deal is, but that, that was something. <laughs> let's take a look at the salaries. I don't know why it glitched out. Must have been just too much money. Can't even calculate it. A seven-year right? Like, because the eighth year would be something else. Was that an eight-year contract? Hold up. Wait, what? I think technically it's eight years, but we're just going to say eight years, 307 million dollars. Move aside, Mahomes. Kind of. Not really. Uh, 123 million for the savings. Uh, negative, anyways. Uh, and then 170 mil penalty. So, more than half of it guaranteed. Holy crap, look at these numbers. Jesus. Well, that team's going to suck soon. <laughs> That's quite a bit of money. But obviously, you got to do it. I mean, I would do the same. Damn, son. Where'd you find that? Number 15 overall is their pick. Uh, interesting selection. I mean, he's kind of like a weird hybrid type of player. And then, you know, it's pretty much an AI draft from there on out. It went big in that draft, though. Big men. Another year. Another playoff missing season. Uh, things are starting to look a little dire around here. I'm, I'm not going to lie. Uh, we will have to take a look at the roster after this, though, because we might have lost. I mean, we lost Cameron Jordan. We know that. Ooh. Saints uh, front office is like, oh, God. Oh, God. What have we done? Oh, Lord. 
<laughs> 4,000 yards, just under it. 30 touchdowns, 13 picks. What are the touchdowns and rushing? I mean, kind of okay, but like not good enough to be, you know, passing for only 30, in my opinion. And of course, as far as the awards go, I mean, I wouldn't expect him to be on here. I don't know how, maybe quarterback, I suppose, and number eight, but that, I mean, that's, that's not great. Buccaneers again, and uh, the Raiders are getting in one again. And the Raiders win. Pick four overall. They go with a cornerback, Clyde Smith. Oh, that's a good corner. We talked about this recently. If you catch as high as a corner, you're a good corner. That's simply, they, they intend that to be the case. I know it. Uh-oh. A third-round corner when you just, uh, quarterback, when you just paid a ton of money for one bold strategy. <laughs> what do they expect to do? Like, just kill him or something like is this are they gonna just like off him in like the woods or something and just say like, oh no we can't pay the contract how what actually happens if that happens like i would assume the contract's void right like nfl teams can't afford to pay someone that like dies or something right unless they die because of the, and i don't know well that took a weird uh d d sad turn for the worse hey glad you guys are around for this depressing you know, we're all going to die sometime, uh, you know. Uh, New Orleans, um, please stop. Uh, well, start, I suppose, would be the word here. Rushing touchdowns have been kind of high, but, like, I mean, not really. I mean, the number one, Kamara's getting a lot. I mean, he's getting his. He ain't worried about it, but, like, interesting. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Things are starting to slow down here. I mean, obviously, they have him for, I mean, what, till he's maybe 32 or something like that, but maybe even longer, 33. But yeah, I mean, what can you... Yeah, he's Defensive Player of the Year. Yikes. I mean, it, it's starting to look worse and worse every season. Like, <laughs> Sean Payne's on the phone with the owner. And he's like, uh, what did we do? <laughs> what, what, what happened? I think they're thinking about killing him. I really do. Uh, the Super Bowl. Bengals are in it for like the third or fourth time. And they win again. What the hell is up with them? They are too good. All right, so pick six, the uh, Saints go with wide receiver, and he's got a lot of potential. He could actually become someone good. They go with a really risky middle linebacker, but it works out. I'm kind of curious to see, like, is this guy Superstar, X-Factor, something like that? We'll see. Uh, James Young. I mean, at least he's James <laughs> Young. Yep. That's... I'll get you to stay around, clearly. Of course, if he draft, that wide receiver might have potential, but... Was he really worth pick number six? I don't know. Of course, the team has just been losing and losing and losing. Who the hell is this? Daniel Davis? Meh. I mean, this team's not going to stay great forever, so... Got to think that window's closing. Maybe one or two weeks? If, if weeks. <laughs> That's... Wow, that is... Uh, that is a close window. Jesus. Uh, but yeah, maybe one or two seasons from now. If that... All right, so uh, seven and nine, uh, slightly better, like ever so slight. Oh my lord, the numbers! I mean, those aren't bad numbers. It's just, oh my, what is going on here? I mean, I don't even want to look. I just, I'm just gonna go on. It's just the yards are dropping. I just don't understand how this team's not a playoff team anymore. Eighty-six over, eighty-seven over. Is that not good enough anymore? Detroit Lions against the Texans. I gotta see these overalls. The Lions win the Super Bowl. I mean, that's already just like crazy. Let's take a look at the, the Lions and the Texans. So, the Texans. Okay, fair enough. 87 overall. Okay. Okay, fair enough. They got a good quarterback. I get it. The Lions, 80s. I mean, it's just, are we just losing by like three? Like, I don't know. I feel like uh, Sean Payton would probably be gone by now, though. You paid that kind of money for a quarterback. You expect him to be great. And he's pretty good. And you're missing the playoffs this many times in a row is kind of an iffy one. Pick number 10. The first two picks look all right. Another cornerback. I mean, he's okay. His catching's low, so it means he's kind of like, eh, you know. <laughs> but uh, left end, Emmanuel Northern. Okay, fair enough. You got to look at these guys like, okay, despite their, their devs, are they going to be good? You know, 81 strength, playing kind of like a run-stoppy type role. Eh, you know, it's like an eh. We make the playoffs. A and 8. It's done. Is, was Sean Payne always wearing that coat? I, I don't even know, dude, but it, they make it as to the playoffs, finally. It's all that matters. You just got to make it. And Jamarcus, like I said, I mean, the picks are down, but, like, so is the yards and the touchdowns. I mean, hell, the whole offense is struggling. Uh, is Michael Thomas gone? <gasps> He's gone. He's actually gone. I'm not going to look at the awards because it doesn't matter, but I think this is where the pit of doom, yep, the pit of despair 
goes the Saints, basically. The Raiders versus Washington. And the winner of that one is Washington. <laughs> Not the Raiders again, Jesus. Kind of curious to see what dev Mr. Jamarcus is now. He could be star. Okay, maybe they made Devin just, like, really bad because, like, he should have went down after last season. That's just, that's not superstar caliber. But, hey, keeps him going, I suppose. And 8-8 eight and eight again. However, no playoffs this time. Jamarcus, the yards are back. The touchdowns are, eh, the picks are good, though. Uh, well, they're not good, but, you know, they're, they're low, I suppose. Another iffy season. I suppose he could be winning award. Well, not winning, but he could be in the talks for awards, but... It probably doesn't really matter. We'll take a look at the end of his career. You know, what's going on there. Uh, the the Bengals again. I don't know what, like, uh, okay. 31 to 17. If you say so, I'm really curious to see if Jamarcus is still here. 82 overall. Oh, this team is dropping. Uh, Jamarcus is still here. I wonder if he regressed. 31 years old now? Might have. Uh, down to his last two years on his contract. Uh-oh. And he is a regret. Oh, Lord. Things are happening. Things are happening. All right, Saints. You got to make it happen soon. Otherwise, he gone, gone. And might not even join another team. He might just retire. I don't know. That regression's going to hit hard, I think. Hey, the pa Oh, oh. The playoffs. Yes. There they are. Uh, 10 and 6. This could be the last chance. How are they going down? Oh, a new player at running back. Oh, this team is different. I don't know why I would have expected anything different. <laughs> different. Uh, Castro's still on top of the world, though. You can see 94 overall for a guy that's constantly on the top of the list. I'm telling you, these sliders aren't that high. It's just, of course, uh, Jamarcus was just that good right out the gate. But here it is. Potentially the last time we see the Saints with Jamarcus Russell and in the playoffs. And they... They blow it literally immediately. <laughs> it's supposed to be some grand thing. Oh, what's going to happen? A loss right out the gate to the Bears. Okay. Yikes. Just yikes. That's a bad performance. That's just not good. It's just, it's simply not good. Uh, I don't think Jamar is going to retire just yet. So we'll wait a little bit longer to take a look at those career stats. Just because I don't want to like look at it. And then the next week we look at it. And then the next season. They keep saying week. Season we look at it. The Vikings appear to win their first ever Super Bowl. The re-sign period. Let's see. Did they let him go? I believe they would have needed to sign him this year. 81 overall. I don't know. And now if they re-sign him, it would appear. He did regress a little bit, but not by much. Let's take a look at the uh, the edits. Let's take a look. Watch is going to be another one-year thing. Oh, come on, man. Stop. Please. So it was a one-year deal. Oh, maybe it, maybe it wasn't. It looks like it looks like maybe this was the final season. Okay, so they they didn't re-sign him. I don't think. I think he just had one final year on his uh, his contract there. Draft recap and uh, yeah, I mean they get another star safety, star better safety, but the drafts have been pretty bad, and their off seasons they just haven't been grabbing anyone. Like, the free agents have been really bad. Like, they've just been not great at free agents. Like, they're just choosing the wrong ones. And, like I said, potentially the final season as a Saint, and it's a non-playoff one. Jamarcus is literally thrown for 32 touchdowns every single season outside the first three or four. Like, he's literally, like, as soon as he signed the contract, 32, no more, no less. That was the deal. That was the fine print on the contract. He would agree to that. Uh, the Jaguars and you once again, the Buccaneers for like the fourth time. Resign period, we're going to skip right past that. Hopefully he leave. I mean, well, and, uh, it'd be nice to have something interesting to see or he'll just stay. I'm sad now. He goes down again in overall, but not by a whole lot. Looking at Mr. Jamarcus Russell's contract that he just signed, it was a, would appear to be a two-year deal, right? Two-year deal worth a lot of money. Holy crap. Two-year deal worth apparently like 80, just about. I mean, he's worth it, I th I suppose. But it's hard to say because like a lot of quarterbacks throw kind of similar numbers in sim. So, I don't know. In real life, you probably pay that in, in game. Eh. Darren Grant, big running back. Looks like, actually kind of looks like a lot of fun. 92 Excel as well. He's an all-around do-it, do-it-all type of player. Perfect player, actually. And once again, another draft with like barely any hiddens. 
All right, going to the playoffs, and, well, everyone else but us is going to the playoffs. 3,700 yards, and what a, what would you know? 32 touchdowns. I actually kid you not. I, he's, like, glitched. I don't, I don't know what to tell you. I wonder if he's been making the Pro Bowl all these times. Probably not, right? I'm not even close to the Pro Bowl. He might not have any Pro Bowls, actually. Like, five, maybe. The Lions win another Super Bowl. And now here we are going on to the final con year of his contract. Jamarcus is... I do not know if he'll re-sign here. You know, this is kind of maybe when you would see a guy go, but he's in the 90s, uh, assumingly still. So I suppose he probably will sign even another one. He might actually stay the entire duration of his career. Normal development middle. Normal development DT. Ooh, normal development quarterback in the third round. And then another normal development DT. I mean, you know the drill at this point. 8-8, eight 6-10, and eight, six and ten, pretty much backed and forth. Hey, no 32 touchdowns this time, but he took some of the picks off to uh, take away some of those touchdowns. Leak has been okay. Uh, but I will say the only thing leaking is Jamarcus Russell's stat line every single season. He's been losing a couple every once in a while. The Browns versus the Giants, at least the, uh, as a new team in the NFC, it seems. And the Giants do win. Any regression at all for Mr. Jamarcus? Like, we have regression on. I mean, they might have just, like, nerfed the hell out of it. Uh, it's nerf or nothing, you know? So, I think after this season ends, that's when we definitely will be taking, uh, taking a look at Jamarcus's stats. Because, obviously, he's he's regressing quite uh, hard now. He's a 91 overall. He went down, like, four or five overalls just that season, it would appear. Once again, it's probably not going to show me the contract here, but how many years? It's got to be a one year at this rate. Yeah, it appears to be a one year deal. I mean, he's probably going to play for a new team at some point, right? Like just maybe even a one year deal with a contender that just lost their quarterback. I don't know. Got to give up the loyalty. I mean, not give it up, but got to give it up to him for the loyalty, man. That loyalty uh, runs deep. James Young, hey. Remember when we were like, hey, dude, at least he's James Young? He is James Young. He actually, it actually worked out pretty well for him. Nice. But yeah, let's uh, go on to another season. He'll be 36 when this season ends. So yeah, definitely before we even move on, after we see the playoffs, if he's not in them, we're going to take a look at the stats right away, just in case. I don't really know a whole lot about quarterbacks and superstar. I think at X Factor, they they usually last till about 38 if they're around his overall, but he might just die. I mean, I don't know. I mean, they said they were going to kill him. And they're in. 9-7. and seven. Okay. Here it is. The lowest touchdowns of his of his career. And, you know, top three for picks. Not that it's bad, but 3,600 yards on top of it. Rushing touchdowns were low. So, I mean, just a bad season, honestly, for him. Uh, looking at the awards, he's not going to be on the list. But we'll take a look at QB. Maybe top 10. Not even in the top 10. This is... This is like a Peyton Manning type of situation. I don't care about your breakout or your elbow. They win. Okay, they're moving. We've got movement. And they lose. Oh, no. Of course, they lose the game there. Uh, let's take a look at the actual performances, though. I mean, he got to a Super Bowl right in the beginning of his career. I mean, that would be so strange, wouldn't it? Like, he goes rookie year to the Super Bowl. They choke a 10-point lead. And then they're basically never the same. And he just played so badly in that game. They're basically never the same. Actually crazy. Once again, I think he'll stay probably another year or two. But in case he doesn't, nice little career there, though. 57,000 yards, 451 touchdowns, 136 picks. It's crazy that, like, Matt and Sim is very conservative in the picks department. And the guys like Rodgers are actually going to – Rodgers, Mahomes – Better than that. Like, that's insane, isn't it? Or going to be. Uh, completion percentage, 63% is kind of average. Under 100 yard uh, passer rating, just slightly. 7.7 .7 yards per attempt. 95 longest pass. Uh, 503 sacks taken. Jesus. Andrew Luck. That's why he went. <laughs> I'm not saying I want him to retire, but, like, you know, I don't want to look at the stats another three times because I don't know when he's going to retire, you know? Eagles versus the Browns, and in fairness, the Eagles did win the Super Bowl. Is Jamarcus Webb still here? <laughs> Call him Webb. 88 overall. Regression is still hitting, but he's obviously still absolutely insane. There's a re-sign here, so I don't know. He could be gone. I think they'll keep him. 
I think they'll keep him. He's been loyal. Are they going to be loyal? And they are! Another contract! I sounded like a pirate there. Let's take a look. It's probably another year, a one-year deal. And it is. I mean, hey, I would like to have tracked the money made. He's got to have made about $600 million just from his contract, let alone the... Maybe $600? Let me jump to think. Pretty damn close to $600 million. Maybe, now nah, probably about like five hundred because the rookie deal. But yeah, without the endorsement, this is still a really damn good career, obviously. Advancing to the playoffs, and we're not there. This is the worst season, I believe, though. 5-11. and 11. Touchdowns are down. Picks are kind of, you know, where they are. Just under 4,000 yards. So yards are technically up. Russell with five rushing touchdowns, though. Most of his career. Always seen those weird numbers like that where, like, you know, the latest in their career, they have the highest force fumbles or something. I think that happened with Sean Taylor and this one. Most rushing touchdowns in his career, yet he's probably the slowest he's been. Uh, Detroit back in it again. That Castro guy's good. However, the Jets win. Now, the question is, do we sell with Mr. Russell? And he's still there. Will he still be here, though? That's the question. You might as well, right? You might as well just finish it off so I don't have to change to a new team or anything like that. And they do. Okay, so 84 overall, Jamarcus. This has got to be it. This is literally got to be the final season of his career. There's no other way around it, right? There's just no way. They draft a safety pick number one, uh, number three overall, and he was normal. Then they draft another safety. I I'm sure with your 78 overall roster that safety is such a glaring knee that you took it first and second round picks. Basically two first round picks on it. Good decision. Week 17. Another pl Oh my god. 2 and 14. Like that's not even close. Could you please not? They won the first two games. Oh no, bad. No, they're looking pretty good. Might have a good season. And then they lose 14 in a row. That is some sort of reverse sweep bull crap. I've never <laughs> Russell with uh, another top 5 pick season. Touchdowns are down to 20. I don't know why the Saints don't see that there's issues. They're like, eh. So what if another 10 years down the line he'll be in negative category for touchdowns on the season? <laughs> you know, whatever. Let's take a look at the career stats now. This is most likely going to be his final season. 64,000 yards. Just under 500 touchdowns. He might play another just to get that one. 158 passing interceptions. Uh, as, a as opposed to rushing interceptions. Same completion percentage as before. Passer rating has dropped 2.0 since we last checked he also gave a uh, allowed another like 60 90 sacks one of the two the question that everyone's been asking though how are you doing that's the question the raiders are back in for maybe the third or fourth time and they win so if he would have played i mean in theory with the raiders his whole career he would oh castro retired he came in after hold up and Jamarcus is like, psych, I ain't gone. They're going to pay me more money? Why not? And he finally drops in dev. He's finally star. Now, if there was any argument of whether he was going to play another one, oh, maybe there's a debate this last year, the year before. It's gone now. There's no debate. He is literally gone after this season. There's no question about it. He's still here, though. Played the entirety of his career here. Literally, I mean, he probably never moved a single time. He probably, I, I don't know what it was like high school life or anything was, was like that. But like, he pro I'm just going to skip the draft as well. He probably never had to leave. He literally just stayed the entirety of his career, 40 some years of his life. Insane. Well, just about 40. He's getting there like 38 right now. All right, 79 overall roster. I'm going to be honest. It's a bit of a long shot, but you know, here he is. They also do have a rookie, Troy Cash. I mean, they. I mean, as far as quarterback goes, the Saints are on it. They're they're ready for all uh, all issues ahead. Star development. Troy uh, Cash is his name. How fast was he actually? Oh, that is so much fun. Number 11, 90 speed. Oh, that's so fun. That's so cool. The Saints are so ready for everything. The one draft I skip. The one draft i don't look at and it's like the best draft of all time congrats i mean that right end's probably x factor like he's he's probably the number one overall pick but regardless it's not going to matter because even though they had a couple of bright spot draft picks 
it would be a miracle to get to the playoffs and a super miracle to get to the Super Bowl. All right, so once we once again, we expected us to miss. I will say 8-8's eight eight's not bad. And then Jamarcus has one of his better seasons in the last like half decade or so. Uh, interesting, because you know he's star development now. Now we can look at him, so you, you get the uh, the gist. He did end up over 500 passing touchdowns, which is cool. Passing range drops a little bit again, but overall still a Hall of Fame level career, obviously. Going to the Super Bowl, how old is this man anyways? Speaking of, kind of curious. 38? It doesn't show age. No, he already would have had it. So 39 years old. Jesus. Almost 40. I would have played one more year if I'm him, but let's be honest, he's gone. Let's be honest, he out of here. No way. No way Jamarcus is still here. Get the hell out of here. How is he still here? He's actually insane. I wonder if throw power has a big factor in it. Of course, the Browns versus the Lions, the one we've been waiting for like 20, 30 years now. Or about 20-some years in real life, in game. Tech I don't even know what I'm saying at this point. 35 to 0. Interesting. Going past the resigning. I would assume Jamarcus is gone, right? Like, they had to, like, let him go. They did. Jamarcus is finally a free agent. The question is, will he have a team? That's the question here. He might not have a team. It may be the end of his career because he might not have a spot to go. No, I don't want to see double retirements. That's just not what I've signed up for. Interesting. League signings. Russell with the Giants. He's got a team. Let's go. The question is, does he is he going to have the starting job? Because if he's not, then we won't move and we'll just kind of spectate the season. He will. Okay, Jamarcus. Oh, he's playing till 40. What a hero. What an actual hero. I mean, this video is a lot longer than I wanted it to be, but hey, actually worth it. Well, maybe it's not longer than I wanted it to be. The recording's longer than I wanted it to be, but there was a lot of like suckiness in between like the drafts were trash the playoffs weren't that often i like it i like it 83 overall team as well you never know you never know start of element jamarcus about to be 40 years old an actual hero doesn't even play through his rookie contract in real life yet he gets to 40 here in resim I mean, just, that's why you subscribe, you know? That's why you do it. Wait, how did the Giants finish? 11-5, and five. okay, I mean, got a chance here. Got a chance. I'm not saying it's a good chance, Jamarcus, but I'm rooting for you. 6-10, and 10. Jamarcus, 28 touch. Okay, so, I mean, pretty pretty average stuff. Now, we can all agree, right? I think. That this is his final year. He got over 70,000. Touchdowns at 558. Five, I mean, where does he rank all time? He's got to be on the list, right? No? Yeah, he's right here. I, I, oh, nice. Right there, I mean, he's top 10 for uh, touchdowns, top 10 for yards. I'm imagining he's top 10 for picks <laughs> just because he's played so long. Maybe. Maybe not, actually. Let's go to the Super Bowl. Let's see who wins it. And then we'll see the inevitable retirement of Jamarcus Russell. And if he's not, I will Hannah Baker myself. I'm just kidding. That was too far. The Colts win the bowl of soup. Congratulations, soup winners. Wait, did he not? Did he not retire? Is he crazy? There's no way, dude. I mean, he's not on this team. But, like, is he actually for real? There's no way. There's actually no possible way that this has happened. Okay, so I think he is still there. Where is he? Diddy? P. Diddy. Oh, there he is. 40 years old. I don't think he's going to get a team, though. If he does, he's a backup. This is kind of just sad now. Like, now he's just got to, like... He's just got to go. Like Somebody's got to just like sweep him under the, the rug. I, d I don't think he has a team. I think he's a free agent, and I think he's going to disappear. All right, we'll find out. 
Jamarcus is in free agency. It's a sad day. And it's a weird one. But I believe the Jamarcus Russell train has ended. How is he still here? I don't know. Why won't he leave? I don't know. But that's about it. Jamarcus Russell retires pretty much at the age of 41. I guess it doesn't really count. Like he didn't he didn't really play another season, right? So I mean I'll I'll go until it actually says he retires, but I don't know if he's actually gonna be on the team. I might actually just sign him just so he can retire. I'm gonna I'm gonna sign him to the Saints at the end and just uh, retire him. I'm gonna do him I'm gonna do him right. Is he don't tell me. Don't tell me this MFR is still here. Where is he? Hello? Don't tell me he's still here. Okay, I think it just like glitched out or something. I, th I think he is actually gone. I can't find him though. Oh, there he is. It just says, I don't know, it's just weird. Oh no, yeah. Why does it say resign though? Jamarcus Russell retires after 19 years in the NFL with over 70,000 yards, over 500 touchdowns. No Super Bowl wins, but he did get to them and to the Super Bowl, and he was eight minutes away from being a champion. But unfortunately, it all went. I will say I did kind of forget to show Pro Bowls and awards, but we all can tell that after maybe year six or seven, it wasn't the case. So I would say maybe five or six Pro Bowls. That's about it. But that was the career re-simulation of Jamarcus Russell. That was a lot. That was very unexpected. I did not expect him to pretty much stay with one team. Obviously, the Giants, we technically count, but interesting, interesting stuff. Let me know in the comment section below who you would like to see next, and that's pretty much it. I mean, I guess maybe a blast in the past idea as well. Maybe people are like, Jamarcus Russell, there you go. <laughs> but yeah, let me know in the comment section below what you would like to see next for this, Blast in the Past, any series at all. Maybe like a Bulldogs player you want to see. I know somebody been saying uh, Darrell Rivas a lot. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, not every suggestion is going to be accepted, but maybe they will. I don't know. Regardless, thanks for watching. If you're new, maybe subscribe. Like if you liked it. If you didn't, dislike it. I mean, it's up to you, man. Uh, maybe follow me at Twitter. I hope you care. Check out, the, check out the second channel, PKR Plays. Been playing Cyberpunk over there. And then maybe follow me on twitch.tv slash PKR. Regardless, thanks for watching. Hopefully you come back next video. But until next video, see ya!